want to begin tonight with Eric Mock. He's in Cherokee County as cleanup there for many just beginning. Eric. Yeah, Eric, you know, we just talked here in Cherokee County, and he told us that there's at least 1,500 trees down from this storm here. And while none of them are on top of Dylan Harrington's home, they came very close here in his backyard. You can see where just a path of destruction has been cut through his backyard from these very intense winds, including some very thick oak trees that came down in his yard. Now, the EMA director, Daniel Westbrook, says they estimate the wind speeds in this part of Cherokee County got up to 95 miles per hour. That's as strong as an EF1 tornado. And these were just straight line winds from a thunderstorm. Harrington was here when the ferocious winds tore through his property. And he says he'll never forget the sound of the trees cracking. When that tree fell, it took about five others with it. So all you could hear is just, I don't know if you've ever heard a two by four break in half, but times that times a thousand, you know, and that's what you hear. So it's intense. Now, Westbrook told me at last check, close to 4,000 people were still without power in the county. He says county crews are actually assisting linemen to try and get power back up and running all over the county. Now, Harrington says while he's got a lot of cleanup here in his backyard, he counts himself as one of the lucky ones. Some of his neighbors had trees come down on cars or houses, and we're going to continue to show you more of that damage coming up tonight at 10 and 11. For now, reporting from Cherokee County, Eric Mock, Fox 5 News. Yeah, Eric, just seeing those trees down like twigs, like nothing even happened. Thanks so much. We'll see you tonight at 10.